What up, YouTube? Team Moves here. Here is my review for this new Netflix uh, series, uh, adult anime series, Tired Hoops. Now, the series is uh, from um, Phil Lord and Chris Miller, and it features the voice of Jake Johnson. It's a basketball uh, series that takes place during uh, during Kentucky and all. And anyway, uh, here. Here's what it's about. Uh, in it, Coach Ben Hopkins, voiced by Jake Johnson, helms the uh, Lenwood uh, High School Coast, which is a basketball team so terrible that if they lose uh, by 40, um, it's a win. But Ben throws, of course, uh, chairs and uh, referees, you know, eject him, and referees end up uh, rejecting him from games for his uh, language and all that. And he also he also had a wife uh, named... Uh, Name Shan, voiced by uh, Natasha Leggero, but she's actually uh, now dating. They end up getting divorced, and now she's dating uh, pretty much the assistant uh, coach, voice uh, named Ron, played by uh, voiced by Ron uh, Fuses. Uh, you got Rob Riggle, who voices uh, his you know pops, um, Ben's pops in this. Rob Riggle is really hilarious here, and uh, he's also trying to uh, turn this uh, team into uh, pretty much into winners. And uh, his star um, athlete is this kid named uh, Maddie, voiced by AD uh, Miles. It kind of reminds me a bit of uh, of the son of the uh, oldest son from uh, *Efforts for Family* for some reason. Uh, not sure why. I'm good. Just, but anyway, uh, Netflix. We all know they, they are great when it comes to adult uh, anime humor. I mean, we've seen that with *Big Mouth*. We've seen that with *Efforts for Family*. And to be honest. I gotta say, this is actually much funnier uh, than most people may ask me because it's not getting the best reviews. As I last I checked, it has an 80% on Rotten Tomatoes. A lot of people are not digging it, so the reviews aren't that great. I quite enjoy it. It's really raunchy. It's dirty. It has lots of fun, dirty humor in it. Jake Johnson is just—he is best known for playing Nick uh, in New Girl. He also uh, voiced uh, Pierre Park in Spider-Man: The Spider-Verse. You're just hearing Peter Parker cursing throughout this whole film. I mean, this film has no bars. It is one. It, it's a real. It's a real uh, dirty uh, flick, you know. I mean, there is lots. Of, there is a whole lot of cursing. Uh, I mean, I guess you could say this is like bad Santa, but you know, if he was a, a coach instead of you know, instead of Santa, or maybe more like a RA version of Bad News Bears in a way, but instead of baseball, it's basketball. Uh, this is a really funny, entertaining uh, series. Uh, I'm, I'll be down if they renew it, because uh, I'll be down to see where, um, like, where the shows get will go for uh, season two. So yeah, if you guys have not seen uh, Hoops, I'll say give it a shot. I mean, it does feel like uh, you know other sport movies we've seen. Like it feels like a uh, adult, R, like an R-rated anime version of the uh, Gene Hackman classic Hoosers. Uh, there are some really fun pop culture references. Uh, like Lil Man Tate is referenced a whole lot. Uh, the Godfather's referenced a whole lot. And this is a it's a pretty fun show. So if you guys have not seen it, I say give it a shot. Anyway, uh, let me leave you guys. Have you had a chance to check out uh, Hoops? If so, what you do of it? Did you like it? Did you not like it? Would you be down to check out season two? Drop the comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that bell for more notifications. This here, see me sign off.